A Testament Against the World, The Lord's Rebuke. The cup of the wrath of my fury is come to the full. October 7, 2011. From the Lord, our God and Savior. For all those who have ears to hear. Behold, a great battle cry is heard. The voices of my watchmen are lifted up against their own people. For the enemy dwells within the gates. My witnesses fight in the name of righteousness. Yet those within the gate will not give heed. They refuse to come out of their sanctuaries. They will not depart from their man-made temples. Wicked and slothful servants. They know not which master they serve. Yet I tell you, they serve Satan. And by their rebellion have they declared their allegiance. For they have hated me and my Sabbaths. And of my book, they see it only as a lever by which they may move the people to conform to their will, perverting my word in Scripture. For the love of money, they seek always to expand their churches, increasing their storehouses of wealth and building up their riches by authority in my name. Shall I not repay? Shall I not set all these crooked paths straight? For the heart of this people is corrupt. They remain lost in their own deceptions. Thus, they have indeed provoked me to anger. Therefore, as it is written, I shall make my words in the mouths of my prophets fire, and this people would, and it shall devour them. For the people treat my words with contempt, and do not cease from crying, False! False! Behold, they liken my prophets to predators, and speak of my messengers as though they were brute beasts risen up from the past, as snakes rearing their heads across the ages. Therefore my servants shall indeed bite them, as the adder they shall rear their heads and strike. Like the fangs of a venomous snake shall their words pierce and flow into the veins. And with the strength of a brute beast shall my servants pass through the midst of them, and not one shall have strength enough to withstand them or prevent them by any means. For I am great in power, and nothing in all creation is able to restrain me, nor shall any prevent my word from speaking when I pour out my fury upon the desolate, says the Lord.